you think vans, what comes to mind? Probably something big and bulky and thirsty like this old thing. We're gonna change your thinking about vans right now. The Transit Connect has a couple of different EcoBoost engine options, four-cylinder, and the EcoBoost is becoming Ford standard, of course, as we've discussed in previous Richard's Ride videos. What's interesting about this EcoBoost, it's a 2.5 liter, about 170 horsepower, and it is really peppy. So when you think vans, peppy is not usually what you'd describe a van as being, but this one really is. It moves pretty well, and uh, for a four-cylinder engine, it's got some pickup. The EcoBoost engine should get you 23 to 30 miles per gallon, depending on your driving habits and how much city or highway driving you do. The uh, cargo van nature of this vehicle is what it's most known for. However, in this passenger version, it does come with these leather seats and it does have the Ford Sync system to allow you to integrate your phone. And it has the comforts of any of the other Ford models, including the screen that you've seen, the touch screen with the radio and the sync system integrated, including navigation as well. The Transit Connect has its roots as a cargo vehicle and a work vehicle. So it has neat features like this overhead storage bin which just allows you to set maybe a laptop or a notepad up here and uh, have a place to stow it while you're driving. The Transit Connect has a pretty cool skylight of sorts. It's not exactly a moonroof, but it does let a lot of light in if you bring the screen back and give you the sense that the vehicle has even more space. Backup cameras are going to be standard here shortly in all vehicles. Of course, with a vehicle like the Transit Connect, which is tall and a little bit wide, you definitely want to have that backup camera, and it works well in this version. This particular model, the XLT, does not have the backup warning system, but you can get it as an option so that if there's an obstruction back there, it'll beep and let you know. The Transit Connect has largely been a cargo van, but Ford now is in the business of trying to market it as a station wagon or minivan kind of concept. Even with some terrific seats here in the smaller version, which fold down and up, if it makes sense, we'll show you here, to reveal a lot of cargo space when you need it. The Transit Connect is part minivan with sliding doors like this, make it really easy to jump in and out. It's also part adventure vehicle with the available roof rack. You can strap a kayak up there and take off for the river. I'm here with Kim Welch at Lakeview Ford, and here's the cargo version of the Transit Connect. You know, our passenger version has a lift gate. You can get the cargo or the uh, passenger version with this cargo door feature, and that's kind of cool because they open up nice and wide, don't they? Yes, up to 90 degree angle, so you can get tons of space, you have tons of room to put pretty much whatever you need to in there. 